Yo guys, it's your boy Pira. It's another one, man. So on this one, we're going to be talking about how to set up your man of wealth V3 Plus Ultimate on a trading terminal, which is going to be trading tra like MetaTrader 4. So without wasting any of your time on MetaTrader 4, guys, I just want to get white sweat into it and just show you what we mean by setting man of wealth on MetaTrader 4. So guys, just download the system that we showed you uh this is your metal for two plus meter trader four and those two images that we've given you that we've already said you know what man just have them just have them just have them and just you can save them into a folder or whatever it is but just save them for safekeeping or place them on google drive and have them saved so without wasting any of your time, let's just go right into it. So here we are, open your trading terminal and log into your trading account. I've already logged into mine. If you haven't, if you wanna, if you don't know how to go about it, because most of the clients that use the system, they don't know anything about trading. And yes, you don't need experience to that, but you should be able to know your trading terminal and how it does. We have a video on that on how to use Meta Trader Four and Meta Trader Five go to those two youtube videos and just watch it's as simple as apc nothing complicated don't worry so if you want to log into your trade account you can simply log to a trade account if you know your saver and your broker and if you're using the terminal of your broker just like we've explained on the previous video that you don't need uh, multiple trading terminals in order to use uh, different brokers you can use different brokers from one terminal just like you see here, I've got trade two four five and Exodus over there. How did I do it? I just go to open an account and just drag this little thing down and just say add new broker, like broker name or address and like that. So let's say I want to use Derev, but this is MT4, Derev doesn't have MT2. So let's say I just want to use any of my local brokers like um, Ion Forex, uh, Ion FX. You can just simply come here and say Ion FX. Or if you know their server, just say IonFX and say scan. And it will search for IonFX. And once it's done, it will give you that. So I'm not going to wait for it to end scanning. There it is. You can see you got your rail and a demo. And you just click on that. And voila. You start trading using those uh, your recommended broker or your preferred broker. So without wasting any of your time with that, I've already logged into an account. So how do I set up? my system so guys make sure you have this system file it's an ex4 file for meter trader 4 it won't work on meter trader 5 this file only works on meter trader 4 and you've got those two pictures that we have there and just say copy and remember you already saved them on the on the folder and so on and so on so don't confuse any of those system with the system that you already have and just go to file open data folder and go to mql go to expects and here you can create a folder and name it man of wealth man of wealth ultimate m24 v7 you can name it whatever you want that won't affect anything to do with the system and you can paste all those three files that you have and after pasting card more, cut those two images and just go to MQL4 and go to images. Because it's an image, we want to leave them under images. So just like that, we are done with the setup. You just close that, that and just go to experts over here and say refresh. If these two windows don't show, if this navigator doesn't show, just simply go to view and click navigator there and it will show over here. And there is your man of wealth right there. And if ever like this one doesn't show as well, you can just go there and say market watch. And there it is. And if ever this one doesn't show, you can do the same. Go to market watch and go to terminal. You see now I've just removed it. Now I've just added it back. And if ever like you want to pop in a chart or a market that you want or that doesn't show over here, just right click and go to symbols. And you can select any of those market instrument that you see over there 
So without wasting any of your time, I'm just going to go ahead and show you how the setup ends up like. And I'm just going to go to 15 minute time frame. And if ever those things don't show over there, just go to view once again and go to bars, standard charts, lines, time frames. Make sure those things have been checked. And then here is your algo trading part, man. And just fix your chart. I've already showed you this stuff from the videos about how to use Meteor Trader 4. And with that, there is our system, Meteor Trader 5. If you want to attach into the chart, you can either drag it and leave it there. Or you can just right click into it and say attach to chat with that a window pops and about gives a little bit of a link warning change trail point step above three size maximum long or short trades use 15 minute time frame and in here just a little bit of input settings euro usda the major currencies etc use trail points to step to above five those are just input settings that you're supposed to use when you're trading things like euro sd and you have to change those input settings like here yeah, the trailing point you say it's true you can always go back and check it says trail point it's true your trail step is true your trail above is fine and then this is what simply means trade trade size i mean like your trail points is true your trailing step is true your trail above is fine and just like that and you can choose any trade size you can use based on your account size we already have the guide that talks about this if you don't if you haven't seen the guide this is the guide and this is what i'm talking about go ahead and read about it we've already simplified everything for you the boom and crash all those markets that you can try on meter trade of five meter trade of four day it is your lot size the minimum lot size you can use your trade points your trader step your trade above and the recommended time frame and the position sizing that you can use for each and every account that you have you can multiply that by a factor in order to make it appropriate to your account size. And with that, everything everything that you need to do has been done. Like your maximum long, maximum, yeah, your maximum long trades, your maximum short trades. This is just the number of trades that the board should open for sales. This is for buy. And the trade size is your lot size. And your trade step, those are the input settings that makes the board run profitably. So if you miss that, then the board won't work appropriately. And you got that for currency pairs, cryptocurrency, indexes, indexes too. And again, guys, go under common and make sure this is also ticked on. If it's not ticked on, whether algo trading here, auto trading is, is green or black, it won't do anything. But if this is ticked on and you say, okay, and then uh, just also make sure after doing that, this is also okay as well. Because you see here, it says account authorized. That means the account has been authorized. It gives you a user, admin Peter, that's my name. And our email if ever you need support. And the phone number to tax if ever like you need agent intervention. And there it is, your metal file victory plus ultimate. Looks good, looks yummy. If you don't add those pictures, this won't show. This won't show. If you don't add those pictures on images, this won't show. And you can run multiple charts, guys. The minimum of charts that you can plug the system in at the same time has to be five charts. Because remember, the system takes time to scan the market. And once it starts scanning, it takes time to do that. So please make sure that you have everything under control. Like you put multiple markets so that the system can detect and just make sure once you, you do that uh you put multiple charts onto the into the system just make sure the number of positions stay the same your maximum longs and your maximum short trades stay the same and the lot sizes that you have you can differ it doesn't matter with that but just make sure the number of trades stays the same or you can change it it doesn't really affect anything i'm just you know just giving you a heads up according to your trade size it won't open all of them at once so just like you see we op like we we'll put five and five over here doesn't mean it's going to open ten it will only open five trade whether on euro usd at the same time at grip region usd that won't affect anything it's going to do that appropriately unless if you change here and go to ten it will definitely do something else so with that guys with that being said that's how you run your man of wild vitro plus ultimate on meter trader four watch out for meter trader five more to come more to to be shared hit that like hit that subscribe 
and share it with family, man. It's your boy, Peter, signing out.